welcome back everyone to Let's Play Earthbound episode uh, 30, 38 or 39, something like that. Anyway, in the last episode we made it through the Desert Sphinx and we lost Ramen because some crazy old dude with a, turned into a tornado stole him. Well, not really, essentially kidnapped him, he said he didn't have much of a choice in it. And now we entered Dungeon Man. We also found the legendary caterpillar, which we killed for 27,000 XP. But that's neither here nor there. Mystical record kill. <coughs> <coughs> oh dear, excuse me. Anyway, so in this episode, we're gonna try to make our way through Dungeon Man, which up oh, some somehow that poop snuck up on me. Then it, it made more poop appear. Alright, it's okay, I get to kill it. 12 XP each. It is worthless protoplasm. Ah, uh, this sign says at the end of it, place name at a dead end, you're free to take it. Brick room. Essentially what he means is at the end of every... At the end of every, uh... Dead end, there's gonna be some sort of presence -y. And now you want to search all the presents in here, because some of them are good, some of them are not. There's another rest bench. You have a long way to go get some rest, and the relaxation save you. Well, explore the desert, why not make a pit stop? Brick road, we come in here. I wonder why I'm in this restroom. Just who am I? What is life all about? Oh, I'm sorry, did I make you nervous? I'm not dangerous. I'm just in the bathroom with the giant man. Oh, man. And you head up here, and once again, there's a present at the end of the road. Couple life noodles, always nice. Check the sign, there's a useful item at the end of Dead End after you take a long walk. Brick Road. That's right, Brick Road is a pretty nice guy. He gives you a lot of good stuff. You come this way, and you head this way. And it'll be like, up here. Ah, oh, there we go. Another present, there's a snake inside. Ah, oh, yeah. Fucking snakes. Thank you. Oh, a cup of coffee. It was one of those coffee guys. Ah, oh, dear. Alright, and we head around this corner here, around the bend, and there's another present. There's a super plush bear inside. Plush bear inside, yeah. Now we got a free super plush bear. Considering that ramen is no longer with us. Anyway, as we continue our way through Dungeon Man, it gets pretty annoying actually. It won't be too bad. Now you'll come to this point right here, and it'll be like, choose a rope, and then you check in. It says, no matter which one sign you say, it'll all say the same thing. Grass is green on the other rope. I wonder why. If you turn the third rope here, climb up the third rope. You'll actually go the way you want to go. See? And you'll head into this area here. The second floor of my body, Brick Road. And you'll see those holes there. And you'll be like, what's, what's with them holes? See, so you open the present, inside is $10. Wow. Monetary value of this pain in the ass level. But, at the end of this area, once again, there's another rest bench. You need to take a rest. You wouldn't really need to, and these are desert rod. No, these are the less mooks. Now, for mooks, make sure you kill them as fast as possible. Because they will fuck you over if you don't. A mook can ha I think they have diamond eyes. And a diamond eyes is a one-hit kill. You will die instantly, there is no surviving it. Doesn't matter how much health you have, your life will become zero and you will die. Now Tim's actually pumping out damage with that broken can and I'm proud of him. But just make sure you keep those diamond the diamondized guys at bay. And 
Nice, the Robo Pump. As you know that from Loonside. Same enemies from Loonside. Just kill them before they count down and blow the whole world up. But as you can see, the second floor actually doesn't. Work. You have to go down on the actual floor floor here. Go around this bend. And it says, You're standing right now around my belly button. The end. <laughs> Brick Road. There's nothing that way, it's a sign. Climb up here, run into this guy. It's another lesser move. I'm not hesitating to kill these things. There we go. Because he can sleep diamond eyes and he can do a lot of pain in the ass things. You don't want to deal with him. Don't let him diamond eyes you. Can't express that enough. Dude, there's a fucking pizza inside. Oh yeah. Pizza power, yo. There's a sudden guts pill inside. Well, that's a fucking useless fucking weapon anyway. Oh, the present, there's a side caramel inside. Eh. I guess I can use that. There's a side caramel inside. Oh, oh wait, before I forget. Alright. Get that out of here. That's extra space in my inventory. And then you check here and it says Mad Duck. <laughs> Mad ducks can make nice pets if they stay away. You can read this sign here, and it says Gruff Goat. They're really gruff, kind of goat. Frick Goat. Slimy little pile has a bad habit of burping. Frick Road. Let's talk about all the different monsters he's captured here. Oh, shit. Coming over here to this present. And I'm checking the present. There's a whistle inside, and then there's a resting bench, and I'm gonna go to bed. Through the night, even though it wasn't. But that's okay. And then we head up here, and then there's like little mini flying saucers. Right there. Oh, my frame rate. Holy shit. Holy shit. It's like wading through super sticky syrup. Check. Good job, you made it. Brick road. That face is mine. Feel free to talk to it. Brick road. Welcome. Long time no see. Mr. Tim, we met in winter a long time ago. I am Brick Road. Dr. Andonuts made me into Dungeon Man. If you want, I'll come with you guys. The return hole is over there. Jump in that hole and then walk out. So, the return hole. If you check this sign, it says return hole. Jump in. Brick Road. But if you come over here... It says, goodbye exit. Someday you should enter this with courage. But don't worry about it too much. Just leave the return hole. But before you jump through a second time, make sure you come over here and grab this IQ capsule. Because all IQ capsules can be used right away on Jeff. Well... Tim. Always. And just keep jumping through these holes. And there we are, to the exit. And now you can leave, and Brick Road will follow you, Dungeon Man. And he actually fights with you. Oh my god! 
Ah. I'm a photographic genius if I just say so myself. Okay, get ready for instant memory. Look at the camera, said he say, a oh, fuzzy pickles? Wow, for the great photograph, it always bring back the fondness of the memories. Whee! And that's the end of that. Now, as I was saying, Dungeon Man and the Dungeon Man theme walk here, which is pretty cool, is actually a Beatles-related song in the background. I believe it's just a sound clip from it, which is a pretty cool Easter egg if I, uh, not really an Easter egg, but a good, ah, uh, what, what I'm thinking of. Eh, whatever, I'll think of it later. But anyway, it's pretty nice, and it's a pretty cool thing. Oh uh, yeah, totally scrapped. But even the name of the game, the original game's name, Earthbound, is actually called Mother, and that is also based on the Beatles song. It's pretty, pretty cool. Gurg, oh no, I am, I am getting caught in the palm trees. Mm, I can't move. Well, if I cannot move, it is okay. I must say goodbye. My internal resting place is here. Marauding Octobot again. These things you just don't learn. Alright, kill the Marauding Octobot. They're not too bad, they just managed to make you cool. Hey! A scary place called Deep Darkness on the other side of the river. Monsters are very strong and you can lose your health just by staying in the swamp. Do you want to cross river even though you know it's a stupid idea? The swamp is bottomless. Even if you're swimming, you'll be dragged in. It is a different story if you have a submarine, though. Well, it just so happens we have a submarine. A submarine. I believe that I have one in my old vehicle position. Please enter. And now... You gotta go through Dungeon Man again. So, in the next episode, I'm gonna meet you at the top of Dungeon Man. Because I don't feel like having you guys watch me go through this again. Alright? Alright, everybody. In the next episode, we'll continue by getting the Yellow Submarine from Dungeon Man here. And we'll head to the deep darkness. Dun, 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 dun!